Welcome back to the live stream. That was contestant number 25, Vocal Revolution. But we are here right now with members of the new tradition. Welcome. Hey. Thanks, Debbie. <laughs> nice to be here. Nice to have you here. So please introduce yourselves to our friends at home and tell them who you are and what you do with the chorus. Sure. I'm Dan Wessler. I'm the musical director of the chorus. I'm Barry Kane, and I'm the choreographer. Wonderful. So you, that's the musical and the visual all represented right here. Yep. And um, so tell us about how you brought the package of music together today. Sure. Well, the, the two songs were If I Only Had a Brain from The Wizard of Oz and uh, Stairway to Paradise, which is an old Gershwin tune from um, An American in Paris, I think, right? right. Yeah, right. I was right. There's a lot of Gershwin, you know, you don't get them straight. Um, but it was actually, um, we qualified in the fall with kind of a Wizard of Oz set. We oh. had If I Only Had a Brain, and we had a Patrick McAlexander arrangement of Ease On Down the Road from The Wiz. Wow. So it was kind of a cool juxtaposition. Um, but Ease On Down the Road, it ended up, it just didn't fit our course as well as we thought it might. Um, you know, it's a great arrangement, awesome. Just didn't fit us as well, so we were looking for a new uptune. Um, and Stairway to Paradise is actually something I've wanted to arrange for a really long time. And every quartet I brought it to for an idea is like, no, we don't want to do it. <laughs> and so I said, new tradition, how about this? And they liked it, so I finally got to well, arrange and, it. Yes. You know? And basically, you're the director, so you said, hey, how do you love this? Because it's mine and I'm, you know, yeah, I'm just yeah, kidding. Little, yeah, right, exactly, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's great, that's great. And how lucky you guys are to have an in-house arranger to do arrangements that fit the chorus. That's fantastic. And it's interesting when talking about arrangements, you know, an arrangement can be fabulous and can be everything you want it to be and then not necessarily work. Sometimes things just don't fit our ensembles as well as we would, would like. How is the decision-making process for you and the chorus in terms of saying, you know what, we're going to leave it? Is that an easy thing to do? Is it a process you go through? Well, I mean, sometimes you just don't know until after you've rehearsed it for a little bit. And, you know, unfortunately, sometimes maybe you wrote an arrangement for a show and you don't, you don't really realize until a couple of weeks before the show that it's a bad choice. And that kind of stinks, because, oh, I guess we're going to do it anyway. Yep. But yeah, I mean, it, I, I like to think that I'm arranging. I, I, after two years with these guys, I kind of have an idea of our, our strengths and our challenges and everything, so it's easy to kind of figure out how to, how to write for them. That's Absolutely. great. That's great. I, I was just curious. I know when um, uh, Four Voices first did, if I only had a brain as a ballad, as it's done, you know, we're used to it now, but when they first did it, there was a little mixed reaction in the audience at first. Do you get that when you sing that for general audiences, like on your show, it starts out all ballady and then you sing, <laughs> if I only had a brain, a little bit of a titter or a little, like a little. We, I, little... I haven't noticed that. We, um, we sang it at our spring show and they got it. I remember seeing four voices do that and you're you know singing it and you, you, you're not sure what song you're it like, is i know this song but yeah i know yeah. this i what is what's going on and then all of a sudden oh yeah right. oh we got it um and it, that was just so amazing when they did it yes. yeah 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 i guess that so, oh yeah moment is kind of just as satisfying as knowing the song from the beginning if not more right. having that realization and being like okay okay <laughs> yeah Absolutely. That's great. So what's on the horizon for the chorus following the international appearance today? Well, we do a pretty big holiday show right. every December. So as soon as we get back from the international, we're going to start learning holiday music. We do, uh, you, want, you know about that? We did, uh, yeah, the, uh, this year it's um, the second week of December. And uh, two shows, a matinee uh, on a Saturday and Sunday. And uh, we do that every year. Usually it's the first weekend of uh, December, but given the, where Thanksgiving falls, so it's go a to Chicago different. and go to the go New to Chicago. Chicago. Holiday Show. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see you shortly.